Welcome to Good Mythical More. Look at that gift of Cali. Look at air. We're donating $1,000 to Scholarship America to aid in their mission to develop leading scholarship solutions and help students fulfill their college dreams. Please join us in giving at scholarshipamerica.org. Right. Thank you for being your mythical best. Our mission is to determine the most satisfyingly crunchy crunch of one of the top chip brands. So we're kind of going with like the best the, the best selling chips. I know there are like super in fact, don't you don't you remember there was a brand of chips that came out in the 80s or 90s called Crunchers or something like that? You know what I'm saying? They came in a in a Oh boys. These. No, 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 no. They were called I know you know this because we would go to like the parties and some some people would be like, "I've got them, the Crunchers." What some, what are they? They were before kettle chips and they were even crunchier than super crunchy chips. Somebody look this up. I'm what gonna is go the crunchiest crazy. chip from the nineties? Was it called like Crunchers? Crunchers with a K? Yes, Crunchers with a K. You I remember, remember that. those? Are they gone now? Um, no. It looks like they. Exist. They were unbelievably crunchy, way crunchier than any of this. What, pull it, pull it off on the. What I was getting at here. is that sometimes people make a chip, and the whole purpose of the chip is just to have a crazy crunch. We're just going to see which ones of these normal chips have crazy crunches. Well, the or most the best satisfying crunch. crunch. So, oh, um, jalapeno was the best flavor. Oh, jalapeno yeah. crunchers. You know My what? Mama brought you, those home one day. You know day? what this is? This was a kettle. Cooked chip before, before kettle. people knew what kettle cooked was. Yes, too early before its time. They yes, said. it was before its time. You're yep, right. Yep. Jalapeno is also an edgy fruit. Now, <laughs> I I got you a a, a foldy, foldy because I think that that's going to give us the best crunch. Well, it's a double crunch. It's a little unfair because it's not exactly representative of an entire bag. I can't even find another foldy. Oh, there's one. Here's the foldy. I feel like I need a reggie as well. There's a foldy and there's a reggie. A reggio. Now, you you want to try to do? Yeah, you want to try to do the fire marshal real? You can. Cause that's a good, that's a, <laughs> that's a good way to test the crunch. I want to I want to I want to test the crunch. You want to test to see how that's a crunch. In is. its uh, natural habitat. I'm gonna start with the normie. Ooh. Now I listen to your crunch. I would I want to give you the opportunity to listen to mine. All right. Your chair's got to stop moving. Yeah, 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 yeah. You kind of took out most of the crunch in your first bite. Yeah. Interesting. Foldy. Okay. I wouldn't call it crunchy. I would call it crispy. Me too. Let me give you a foldy. There's no resistance in a lays. It completely lays down and lets you take it. Yeah. Lay you down and um, this could be an ASMR video if we don't watch out. All right. What so, do you want next? See, we know these are gonna be so crunchy. So, we wanna save it? I think we need to let's save go them. Let's go to Pringletown. The thing is, is it the most satisfying crunch? Let's go to Pringletown. Now, at the risk of sounding stupid for the first time today, uh, I wanna ask you something, I want your honest answer. We should probably only open one box. Okay, All right, we'll save these. Not really a box, I know. I, I'm gonna... It's a jar. <laughs> I, I want you to answer honestly, and I don't want you to just just say what would be smarter than what I'm gonna say. Deal? Deal. <laughs> <laughs> I did not realize until like two weeks ago that Pringles were formed chips from chip scraps. You I thought it was a big long potato that had been sliced perfectly? I never thought about it and I just without thinking about it, just thought that it was a certain way that the that the potato was cut that gave it that surface. And you thought it was normal that they were all that exactly the same? I didn't think about that for much. Well, I mean, you know what? Maybe most people don't, I, did, I mean, 
Who, who, who thought I'm they were asking just you, potatoes? man. Who thought they were just straight up potatoes? Look, I mean, I mean, a, a good number of people. Basically, only David. <laughs> Oh, Chris too. I always Chris? imagined a chip, a, a thin chip paste, like going into a mold. Yeah, but that's yeah, what makes me remind, like it. It like Pringles always remind me that like of someone that yep. takes a potato chip, chews it up, spits it out, and then tries it out into that's a form. I, mean. I just oh. never thought about it, and now that I have realized that, I don't eat them anymore. Well, okay. I'm not gonna eat them right now. Let me just give a couple of votes and reasons for Pringles, okay? They taste First like they've all, been chewed up too. If you, th if you ignore what we just said, a single chip has a lot of crunch, as I just demonstrated a second ago. But because of the uniformity, which you do not get with a typical chip, you can easily double, triple, quadruple to your heart's content, which adds triple crunch, as in this case. A lot of mess too. See, but I can hear the particles. It's like chewing sand. But you liked them before you knew that. I know, but. What if I, I could convince you it was just a one really long <laughs> cylindrical potato? <laughs> choppy, 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 choppy? A GMO potato. No, man, and I, I think it, it disintegrates in your mouth. You get the one chip, you, you, you had five of them, and it's still, in that second bite, it was nothing but just like. I like them, <sighs> I like the crunchiness because it's so, you're in so in control of it. I think these, uh, these ruffles, This is, this is tough. Now you can get a foldy on a ruffle too. There's a foldy. Here's here's a. All right, see, listen up. Oh, it has a deeper sound. Did you hear how much deeper that was? It was like biting into a Lay's and then putting it in slow motion. That's because I opened up my throat. Listen. That's two or three times as deep of the sound. Is it deeper? Oh, by the lace. Lace just makes harmony with the ruffles. Listen. Oh, let's go and let's let's go harmonize. Chip harmony. You know how high that was and how low that was? Daddy ate bass. Mama sang triple. <laughs> <laughs> or mama ate triple. <laughs> yeah. Let's harmonize again. Let's let's do a reverse harmony. No one has anyone ever done this chip harmony. I think we, this is a new thing. Uh, I think we're introducing this is our, it. To did the we world. invent this? We, yeah, I think chip we are. Harmony, yeah, chip harmony. Two different chips eaten in unison harmonizes them. Chip harmony now opening for fifth harmony. <laughs> you see those two guys come out before fifth harmony and chew and eat chips. Yeah. Yeah, man. Chip harmony. I buy a ticket. I'm to that. getting that T-shirt. Daddy ate me. Mama ate dinner. All right. All right. Ruffles has a um, ridges, more of a crunch. I think Doritos is gonna blow both of them out of the water. Ruffles is in the lead right now. Oh man. Whew. Good morning, chip people. Now look, I think we need full chips. This, is, close this is so American of us. It's close just enough. reaching in and just throwing away chips that aren't full triangles. We're like we'll eat those stars. later. I'm just food stuff. Just doing it for effect. I'll eat it all. That's easy to believe. Here we go. So this is chip unison. This is nothing. Yeah, yeah. This, this is just like, two guys eating chips. This is like two lead singers, like our first band. Right. Until I decided one of us needs to play guitar. <laughs> right. All right. Let me listen to you. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. it's aggressive. I like it. A lot of chip in there. A lot of crunch. All right, listen to this. Wow. It's like it came from the back of your mouth and ended in the front of your mouth. Let me see the sound can, wave kind of had a see funny if I can do that. Mm. That's like, that's something you would like record and put on like a sound effect package. Like crunching the chip. This, I think is, this is like that sounds like the type of chip that you'd want to download and put in your 
iMovie. Well, you know that every sound that contributed to Bobby, Bobby McFerrin's Don't Worry Be Happy was just him eating a chip. <laughs> it was just a different, different, chips. A different crunch of a chip. But a lot of people don't know that. I, I, I did know that. That joke would have killed in 98. Now listen, listen. <laughs> listen to this. We found the most satisfying crunch so far. Don't make me pull it out. Have you ever listened to that whole album, the Bobby McFerrin album? Who are you looking at? I'm not enough for you anymore. <laughs> I know you've heard it. <laughs> I haven't. <laughs> the whole Bobby McFerrin album that Don't Worry Be Happy is on? Yeah. What? What is it? Just more? We can do a special react video on the society where we don't get flagged for things. It's just you guys listening to the entire album yeah, it'll blow your freaking mind, man. <laughs> we can make that the next live stream because I guess it would take about 50 minutes. I, don't, I think it's shorter than that. Well, whatever. Join the Mythical Society now if you want to see us do a Bobby <laughs> McFerrin listening party. <laughs> we got to check this out. <laughs> no, that's a. Uh, that's that's, li that's Lion King. All right, listen to this. Last one, then we're moving on to that. Don't worry. That one was weak. I think he got a runt. A runt? <laughs> like the baby? The smallest one? <laughs> but uh, Doritos are in the lead, right? Definitely. Now let's see if that kettle is gonna do it for us. Do not purchase if bag is open or torn. Sometimes you want chips so bag, <laughs> bad that you just, <laughs> you're gonna, you're gonna I buy. I want them chips so bad. I'm gonna I'm a buy an open bag. <laughs> I, I, I'm not gonna lie to you. I have gotten home before and something like peanut butter or something has not had the lid on fully. And I've been like, man, I'm not going back to the store. I just eat it. There's a lot of foldies in here. This is crunchers, man. This is what you were worried about. Crunchers is way crunchier than this. I want you to listen. To, this is a, this is oh. a, Look that's, at that. a, that's like a four-leaf clover right that's there. That's like a damn seashell. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, it folds over so many times, it looks like an ear. Yeah. It looks like somebody's ear, like they fried someone's ear. Is there another one like that? I mean, that's a pretty good find. You know what, I want you to have that one. I can't do that. Take it. I can't accept Take it. it. I, I want you it. to have it. Okay. I already found another one. Look at this, <laughs> right here. It's the other ear. Wow. It, they fried both this guy's ears. <laughs> All right, let's do this together, bugle boy. Oh, 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 man. This is the last performance of Chip Harmony tonight. <laughs> <laughs> We can. We got to take a nap. We, can, we cannot keep we up can, this. We can't come back pacing. on stage after that. No encore. <laughs> we are. We are. We are tanked. <laughs> Man, those are so much crunchier than everything else. But you know what? It's too crunchy. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, it's the most crunchy. It's too crunchy. They, they found the line and they stepped over it. Okay. There's a limit. All right. Well, you heard it here. <laughs> Doritos are the perfect level of crunch. Okay. This that, is too far. All right, they went too far. They went too far. They, they flew too close to the sun. Why complicate things? Just head to mythical.com and buy the Mythical Minimalist set.